Hello, uh, my name is uh, Gurjot Daliwal and I am the research faculty and the interim director of Intertribal Research and Resource Center at United Tribes Technical College in Bismarck, North Dakota. I do research on um, polymers and uh, polymer composites. Recently, I have started uh, my research on uh, bio-based composite materials where I am using a lot of uh, agricultural products such as soybean oil, soybean hulls, uh, corn grains, etc. To, uh, and I see their uh, application in making uh, composites and plastic. So I was awarded the North Dakota EPSCOR grant uh, that, that I used to purchase this uh, heat flow meter device. I recently started a research project on developing the insulation foam from uh, soybean oil. Until recently or currently, uh, they use uh, petroleum-based raw materials to make the insulation materials, which we all know has higher carbon footprint. It emits a lot of greenhouse gases. So it was an initiative on our part to uh, see the usability of agricultural products and uh, North Dakota being so big in soybean cultivation, the soybean oil was an obvious choice for our work. So we started working on soybean oil based uh, insulation materials and uh, this machine over here, it basically tests the insulation properties, the specific heat and the heat flow through any kind of a solid material. So for this purpose, we uh, purchased this machine that was funded by North Dakota EPSCOR grant. And right now, even my other co-workers are also using this machine for their experimental work. All the research work that we are doing, we need more support, we need more uh, resources to purchase equipment. And a lot of grants out there, they normally do not fund the purchase of equipment. So. North Dakota EPSCOR grant was absolutely required for us and we are so grateful to North Dakota EPSCOR for funding our uh, equipment. Why is my research important? North Dakota produces a lot of soybean. It is the fourth largest soybean producer in the country and one of the highest soybean producers in the world. So, with my research work, we are creating value to our farmers and to our people. We are developing the useful insulation materials from soybean oil and at the same time we are cutting the use of petroleum which is used to make all these materials as of now. So I have involved the students of various uh, backgrounds in my research work. I have students from engineering background, I have students from environmental science background, I even have students from chemistry and the, uh, the gen ed background who have helped me in uh, producing samples, testing the samples, analyzing the results and so on. The students say learn a lot. With the, this kind of research, it is something which they will not learn in the textbooks, at least in their undergraduate degrees. What I say to my students is that I will teach you something which you will not find in the books for at least next few years. I will expose you to the lab equipment, to the scientific principles, which uh, you might not be able to see in at least your undergraduate degrees.